Hi everyone, I'm Lisa Inman. I'm with Laying Groundwork out of Missoula, Montana, and today I'm here with Kathy Mangan, who began Laying Groundwork as an offshoot of the Learning Center at Red Willow here in Missoula as well. So the big question on our minds is, what is the relationship between the two? So maybe you can tell us a bit about that. Yeah, let me uh, give you just a brief overview of why the heck these are two separate organizations. So first of all, you know, we founded the Learning Center at Red Willow back in November of 2010. It is organized as a nonprofit um, under the IRS 501c3 code, and we are really focused on trauma resiliency, which is really the idea of using mind-body modalities to support people um, through adversity and even trauma. So it became apparent to me through the time of really building programs and, you know, doing things in the community to support people in difficult situations, that there was a whole other kind of block of need around businesses and organizations and professionals that we were not really able to really uh, fully address under the Learning Center. So, we began the journey of figuring out how to serve that population, and interestingly, about the same time, um, what is called a benefits corporation became legal in the state of Montana. So this is a for-profit organization that is aligned mission-wise with the Learning Center at Red Willow, and it is also a uh, a, a tool that allows us to take the resources that we uh, do through an earned income program situation actually divert them into the nonprofit. So it's really kind of a slick way of continuing to, you know, offer this, you know, kind of, I would say almost um, expanded services into the community and then also create an earned income stream for the nonprofit. So to me, it's like a win win. Yes, and always supporting the same mission of always, supporting yep. community, supporting individuals. And what would you say would be the primary difference in programming and curriculum between the two when people are looking at courses? How, where would they go to find a certain course? Yeah, and that's a really great question because, of course, they're in, in this in this topic of working with adversity and stress and trauma. There's going to be a lot of um, overlap for sure. What you will find, though, on the uh, Laying Groundwork site is that is going to be really an expanded out into the community. So it is less trauma-focused and more day-to-day -day stress and adversity-focused also. And again, we have on the Laying Groundwork site a real... A real uh, real kind of spotlight on supporting not just individuals in the community, but also organizations. Great. So workplace wellness, workplace wellness, yep. leadership. Yep. Leadership. All of those kinds of things which don't really neatly fall under the, you know, they're they're related to, but they don't neatly fall under the umbrella purpose and mission of the learning center. Great. And what can people look forward to this year from laying groundwork? Oh, we have a lot of cool stuff coming up for everybody. Um you know, we have some great instructors. Some of them you will recognize from the teaching roster of the Learning Center. Others are brand new to our organization. But we're looking at a wide range of community-based programs around supporting immune system health, uh, things about supporting sleep, leadership resilience, um, certainly the helping professionals. Helping professionals, as you know, over this last year has been a, um, a big topic of, you know, how do we support this group of people who have been supporting us in our communities right. for the, you know, for the last year. That's been very stressful. Um, I think it's important right now to also do a big push, which we will be doing uh, around leadership resilience. Again, the uh, leadership stress around creating uh, the ability to stay current and relevant and pivot during the, these times of the last year and now as we're starting to come out of it recognizing that things are permanently different than they used to be and how are we going to find a way to manage all of that gracefully. So I think any of those topics um, are the things that we are going to be um, really focusing on over the next at least the first half of the year and certainly into the second half of 2021. Great. So if you guys are interested in finding out more about what's coming up with Laying Groundwork, you can visit the website. It's www.layinggroundwork.com.
Thanks, everyone. Thank you so much.